Hi everybody, it is Brianna Dix with Worcester County Tourism and Economic Development Office, Maryland's Coast. Today I am on a beautiful farm in Worcester County with event chair for the Blessing of the Combines, Becky Payne. I want to know a little bit about this event coming up later this summer, Blessing of the Combines. There's a bunch of history to it. Can you tell us um, how did this start and what the event looks like? Well, they started back in 1997. I have four friends and we were sitting around talking and decided the farmers needed some recognition. My dad owned the Western Auto in Snow Hill and did for 50 years. And each farmer would come in, I'd ask them, they said, you've lost your mind. Who wants to come and look at our, our equipment? So that's the way it got started. Cool. So, and I let them choose the date okay. uh, so that it didn't interfere with their farming. And it, it's turned out real well. We had about 500 people the first year we figured. And now last year, the last year, which was 2019, they figured it was between two and 3,000 people. Wow. Wow, it's a very unique event it's celebrating all the, one, the culture, but the heritage of all of the workers all around Worcester County, Snow Hill in particular, that work hard on our farmland. And you said 24, pushing 24 years now. Yes. So that's yes. very impressive, <laughs> very impressive. And Becky, there's gonna be lots of fun on this event, Saturday, August 6th. Can yes. you tell us who's gonna be there um, doing the blessing? Doing the blessing will be the Snow Hill Ministerial Association. They do a wonderful job. And this year they're gonna do something a little different, which they haven't told us yet exactly what, but they then that is done to keep the farmers safe during the harvest. Wow, and there is gonna be a main speaker that is gonna be Dr. Craig the Urodi. Is that correct? Yes, How do say he's that? the dean of the uh, University of Maryland uh, College of Ag Agriculture. That's very important. He's going to kind of talk about why agriculture is so key yes, and that the is. farmers are vital yes. for this area. What can families expect to see at the event when it comes to... There will be a lot of things for the, the children to do. That was our goal at the beginning is to, for families to be able to come and have a great day, at least four hours of it, and not have to worry about spending a lot of money. So we have a petting barnyard, of which we'll have all kinds of farm animals. Then we have a children's barnyard where there are games, there's the corn pit, there's all kinds of things, sand art that the children can do. Uh, we have the clowns, the strolling magician. We have the children's tractor pool. Of course, we have entertainment all day and uh, the children are allowed to climb on the combines, get their picture taken with the permission of the drivers. Uh, down at the river, there will be the Wheels at Heel car show. Okay, awesome. And you, I'd also mention Smyrna, the marching band, that's, as well as JROTC is also gonna be present. So that's very yes, exciting. Yes, they'll be all in the parade. Oh, awesome. Well, we're really looking forward to it. Can you tell us where people can get more information if they want to uh, see the full website? They can go to www.blessingcombines.com. Perfect. And, uh, there, and any information, my phone number's there, they're, they're willing to, to call me anytime. Awesome. Well, thank you so much, Becky. I'm glad to be here, and we look forward to seeing everybody Saturday, August 6th. Yes, and thank you so much.